Welcome to you. It's so lovely Thank to have you. you here again. It's so nice to be back. Um, I'm just sort of we're trying to work this out. It's less than two years since you first posted, and now you've got sort of over two million followers on Instagram. Over. And now the book. I mean, how does this all feel? How do you come to terms with all of that success? It's, I don't think you can. I, right. I don't think you can. I can't believe I'm, I'm sat here with you guys and I'm just on this sofa that I watch every morning. To me, it's just, it's bizarre, bizarre but I'm, yeah. I'm so grateful. Is it a bit so overwhelming? Grateful. Yeah, yeah, but in a really good way yeah. because yeah. all my hinches are so, so friendly that we all help each other and I'm doing it for them. Well, I love the <laughs> fact that you actually, actually said that, that, uh, that you, they, they are the ones that have changed my your life. life. Yeah, that's how, that they, they message me and they'll say, oh, Mrs Hinch, thank you so much, You're, my, my life's changed, you've really helped me and I think, guys, it's the other way round, yeah. like, my life's completely, completely changed but... I'm trying to keep it as normal as possible. At the same yeah, time. no, yeah. I'm sure. And actually, cleaning has helped you, hasn't it? I mean, you've spoken out sort of in the past that, you know, when you were at school, that you were a bit of a worrier and you worry about lots of things and anxiety is sometimes a problem and that the cleaning really helps you with it that. It does, it does. In I, what way? I think when you're... Well, there's no worse feeling than when you're, you're sat there and you get, like, that, that heat in your chest and you start worrying and, and panicking for no reason, you don't even know why, but... It, it, you can't get rid of it. So for me, I will, I'll get up and I might grab my mop or I'll grab my hoover and I'll get going. And when you feel you're most weakest, you're still achieving something. And like, yeah. I put my music on and I just crack on. And well, the theme of the, the, the in in the book yes. uh, here, which I, I which I love the fact that uh, this uh, is a it's been a bestseller since February. It's not out yet. No, it's out tomorrow. It's out tomorrow. Um, so pre-orders have been amazing. And this is this is the book and. You use music in here. I do. As a help. Yes. Um, my little hinge list, my little playlist. So tell tell me how that fits. How do you how do you how do you pick what you want to listen to? I think songs they get you going, they get you motivated. And I've got so many songs that you'll put on from R and B and back in the days and I just start you can't help but just your shoulders mm -hmm. go and you get going. So I've just listed my all my fave songs in my book and all my hinches, they message me when it's on my story and say, that's a tune, I remember that, mm. Mrs Hinch. So I've, I've listed them all in there for everyone as well. So And actually, it was, it was those followers and, and the, I mean, the dedicated fans that sort of was the reason behind the book because they got mm. lots of questions and, you know, you can only answer so many of them. So quite good to put it all down in one place. Yeah, it was something for us all to have, like, as a, as a team, like, all of us together and... We can refer to it and we know, okay, if it's in the book, that, that's it, you know, and it's, it's, it solidifies everything that bit. And, and it's fun, though, that's what I wanted. I wanted everyone to, at some point in the book, to just laugh at one, one thing, and I've, I think, as cross, I've achieved it. So. Well, I mean, you're not a professional cleaner. No. Um, a hairdresser from Essex, initially. Yes, yeah, quite and, and so, what was the first time? When did you first think, oh, I might post that, and then suddenly, you know, this happens? I think, well, it was it was crazy because there's so many amazing home accounts on Instagram. Like there's there's thousands and thousands, and I used to find myself sitting there looking, thinking, "Mate, I need a bedspread. I need that wallpaper." Like I was going through it, loving everyone's Instagram accounts, and then thought, "I'm going to have one of them. Like I'm going to set one up, and I'm I'm going to try it." And then one day, I had like this this cloth on my sink, and I started using it, and I was like, "This is shining. Like this is satisfying. This is good." And I put it on my story. <laughs> Named it a name, put on a really good song, and then everyone was like, I'm going to do that. Like that, Mrs Hinch, what's that, what's this? And I was, that was it, it was And off. it happened. And yeah. it grew from there. Because yeah. the thing I, is also, you say you do, and you do, we all do. You go through Instagram or Pinterest or whatever, and you're liking, you're liking, you're liking, yeah. that's about, oh, that's lovely, oh, a lovely, lovely house, that's a lovely carpet. But in actual fact, you know, that's not real life. No. Real life doesn't look like that. No. I think as well, with, with social media nowadays, there's all this pressure of having everything, everything has to be expensive or, or designer or amazing. And mm. I love a bargain and I love, a, like, I love helping everyone else find these bargains. And I'd rather promote the, the best cleaning product out there than I would the most expensive designer bag. It's just the way that I am. And yeah. I think there's so much pressure out there nowadays. So to scroll through and think I can achieve that and it's not too far away in the distance, mm. you know, it's... It brings everyone together. You, congratulations, because you're Thank expecting you. your yeah, first baby. baby I know, it's so <laughs> sweet. Do you think, because I think while there's something new mothers especially find difficult is when, is, is balancing time. And yes. one of the first things that goes out the window when, you know, you have a baby is you can barely brush your hair, let alone run the hoover over. So do you worry that that might 
Do you no, think you still have time yeah, for all your cleaning? I mean, I don't even clean every day. I think people think I'm at home constantly cleaning. I don't. I like to do my little hinch half hours, my little freshen up Fridays, and there might be some days where I'll sit there and go, I'm not even going to touch a cloth today. Like, I'm, I'm so laid back about it. Like, my bed's not made this morning and I'm not worrying about it. <laughs> um, so, for me, it's, it's a case of just going with the flow and I'm um, first time mum so it's all new. I know my hinches will help me because they've said, don't worry, I still have time to clean and mm. I've got three, four kids and I'm like, well, I can do this. I can whack the broom out when maybe baby's asleep and we'll see how we go. But I'm just going to have fun with it and, and yeah. just give him my everything I can. Yeah. We, um, we loved having you. You mentioned that you were last here in September. We loved having you uh, here. There was, a, uh, there was a moment, wasn't oh, there? Oh, God, the mess. You did have a... Uh, I still can't issue. believe that I don't, I don't, well, happened. You're one of the family now, so we can bring this up. And, uh, show this, <laughs> I'm sitting there now thinking I'm on. Show this what? clip. This is um, this is the the, uh, the bra bra issue here. Bra gate. Bra gate. <laughs> These the, stains, oh, smells, whatever on your mattresses. Um, the way to clean, <laughs> and you'd literally sprinkle it on the area. Oh God! So we've got there. So there's there a bit. So if you run that off. through, you could see that you were holding. You're I, holding your top, honestly, and that was because your mic was pulling your bra down. They weigh a ton. These mics. I don't <laughs> know how you do it. So I'm. I'm thinking to myself, right? Okay, it's live. Don't panic. Am I? Am I going to fall out on the cooker? Like I didn't know what was happening. <laughs> and I'm thinking. And then the worst thing is. We hadn't even stopped filming, and I'm running off, and I'm you, like... You did, because people were saying, why did you, why did you run, you run off? Away? I had to tell her... It's in my book, I've even mentioned it. In the book, I've said, guys, this is what happened. You know, I nearly lost my bra live on TV. <laughs> 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 and your first time. But do you know what? It happens, doesn't it? It yeah. happens, it does. Oh, um, that's It's so brilliant. lovely to see you, it really that's is. So nice it's so to amazing back. you're doing so well. You Thank know, keep you. it up. And this is the book that we're talking yes. about. As we said, Mrs Hinch, Hinch Yourself Happy, and that is out tomorrow. Tomorrow. And good um, luck with baby Hinch. Yes. Thank you. Thank you so we'll much. We'll see you soon. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you.